Hey guys, Pete from London Camera Exchange. Today we're going to be checking out something new from Sony. The RX and Alpha series of cameras house some pretty impressive features with the powerful processing, superb image quality, the rapid focusing and that small design. It's no wonder why they've become so popular throughout the content creation community. Sony have spent a lot of time listening to feedback and researching this area of the market and today I'm pleased to announce that they have released this, the Sony ZV-1. Taking all those features we love from Sony and tailoring them into a system for easy content capture and creation, could this be the ultimate vlogging camera? Weighing in at a respectable 295 grams, this stacked one inch sensor camera is a real gel between Sony's latest technology and a whole new design concept. Unfortunately, with the current pandemic, you get to join me here in lockdown whilst I get hands on with the ZV-1, so welcome to my garden. For anyone who vlogs or shoots content from in front of the camera, you will know the most important requirements are that A, you're in focus, and B, the sound is clear. The ZV-1 utilizes Sony's fast 0.03 second hybrid autofocus system, along with the real-time IAF for humans, and real-time tracking, which is quite honestly the most responsive and locked-on focus I've ever used. Having the confidence to hit record and know that you will always be sharp gives you one less thing to worry about when shooting up to 4K movies. No matter where I moved throughout the frame, it picked me up and kept me in focus thanks to the massive 315 phase detection AF points, covering a whopping 65% of the sensor. Having the ability in the menu to set up and change the speed and transition of focus allows you to really customise the final style and look of your videos. With the option of fast, normal and slow in your AF drive speed menu, you no longer have an instant jumping focus if you would prefer to see a smooth, more cinematic pull focus effect. This leaves you with a result that resembles something comparable to shooting with an operator from behind your camera. Skin tone optimization, enhanced color, and face priority auto exposure all help to keep you the main subject whilst on film. Normally when moving from bright to darker areas, the results would leave you underexposed, but with Sony's face recognition technology and the face priority mode, you will always be the camera's main subject with the settings automatically adjusting to keep you visible in the frame. Audio has always been a problem whilst vlogging. Are the built-in microphones good enough? Does your camera have an audio jack? Can you mount a microphone to the camera or do you need some form of bracket to keep it all together? And I'm pleased to say that Sony has taken this all on board. Built into the top, we see a large panel housing a directional three capsule microphone, providing you with the best possible sound that's almost close to the original source. Along with this, the ZV-1 has the option to attach an external microphone via the standard 3.5mm audio jack and top shoe, helping to keep your setup compact and small without the addition of any mounting brackets being needed. Included in the box, you will also receive a windshield to cover the built-in three capsule mics. Unlike other shields which attach via an adhesive, Sony have produced this one to have a rigid base that clicks into the shoe, securing it in place while still keeping it easily removable. A new focus mode called Product Showcase pretty much does exactly what it says. With a quick click of a button located on the back of the camera, you can switch between face priority or showcase mode. This allows vloggers who show smaller items closer to the lens to have a quick and smooth focus transition from their face to what they are holding. Previously, it hasn't always been so easy to get the item in focus or keep it sharp, with some content creators holding their hand up wide behind the product so the camera can pick up and change from the subject. From these two videos, you can really see how reactive showcase mode is when switched on and switched off. Just bear in mind that you are recommended to use a tripod while shooting in this mode and that the internal stabilization turns off. 
When switched on, the stabilization has been enhanced, making it up to 11 times better while shooting video in active mode, making the ZV-1 ideal for when you are moving around and walking, helping to eliminate those shakes and vibrations. So let's talk about the design and build of the camera, because a camera's a camera, right? Well, not quite with the ZV-1. Everything about the Z is tailored to that end user, the content creator. We see a larger than normal movie recording button on top that's easy to access from in front or behind the camera, along with the C1 button that quickly switches between having your background in focus or out of focus, leaving you with a professional bokeh effect. For anyone capturing travel vlogs, this is ideal for when you're just speaking directly to the camera whilst out and about, but then want to quickly change to allow your followers to enjoy the sights around you too. As you can see, my background is pretty out of focus, but when I click that C1 button, it switches to show you more detail from behind me at the same time. To gain this result on another camera, you would have to change the aperture settings, but Sony has made this an instant quick key, or button, you can simply press. On the front there is a small red LED that turns on when recording, leaving you with no doubt that your camera is rolling. The very angled touch focus LCD screen is a lovely addition when compared to Sony's other compacts which only have a tilting screen. This leaves you with a crystal clear view, whether shooting B-roll or capturing a piece of camera, thanks to its unobstructed view located to the side. The inbuilt ND filters keep your shutter speed at a nice low 50th of a second, ideal for your video recordings even when in bright environments. The lens gives you up to 2.7 times optical zoom from its widest position, which may not sound a lot, but certainly gives you a good range for the tailoring of this compact size of camera. The optional accessory of a wireless remote commander was perfect for holding the camera a little over arm's length. Being able to wirelessly connect to the camera allows you to start-stop recording without the need to touch the body. A nice addition to the grip is that it can be opened up and turned into a tabletop tripod, making it a pretty versatile little unit. I only had the ZV-1 for a limited amount of time, but that evening I had a call out to a vulnerable missing person. Some of you may know I volunteer as part of Hampshire's Search and Rescue Dogs, and we can receive a call out text to deploy at any time of the day or night. I only took a handful of clips whilst out with one of the handlers, and unfortunately I hadn't realised I had product showcase mode on, hence why some of my movements are a little jerky due to the stabilisation being turned off. I guess I should get a little geeky with the tech side of things and let you know the following few features that are housed inside the ZV-1. You can shoot up to 4K movies at 30p, which is all oversampled from a larger megapixel format, giving you the best possible uncropped video quality available. You can also step down to full HD at 120 frames per second, or if you want to get super slow mo, you can select this option for a short burst at 960 frames per second, resulting in something perfect for your more high speed moments. Low light shooting is more than acceptable thanks to that 1 inch stacked Exmor sensor and the same Bion ZX processor found inside Sony's flagship A92 and RX100 Mark 7. With an ISO range up to 12800, you can take the ZV-1 into darker areas and still capture content ready to share. For the colour graders out there, S-Log3 is available too, so you can edit your footage in post to get the most out of the reproduction in your shadows and graduations. Or you can shoot directly in Hybrid Log Gamma Picture Profile to instantly show off your content with a compatible HDR TV. Interval shooting or time-lapse mode as most would know it is selectable through the menu setup, allowing you to not just capture still images at 20.1 megapixels, but also create some epic looking B-roll footage too. With built-in Wi-Fi, you can connect to your fans and followers by not only transferring your content to a smart device, but also being able to take full control over your camera remotely. With apps like Sony's Imaging Edge and Movie Editor, you can easily cut your clips together and upload a fully finished video. 
Another great feature the ZV-1 has is the ability to recognise when you shoot in portrait mode. This information is stored so when you transfer your clips to a smart device, you do not have to edit and orientate as it will be saved automatically in the vertical video res, making it perfect for Instagram TV, Stories and other similar apps. With a host of easy to manage settings and the research and time Sony has taken to produce this, the ZV-1 really shows their dedication to content creators. The sharp to blurry background switch, larger than normal movie button, front LED to indicate your recording, those three capsuled mic system along with the audio input jacks, flipping screen, 4K video recorder and that ultimate focusing package. It appears that the ZV-1 is quite possibly the strongest contender to take its position as the ultimate vlogging camera. Don't forget to hit subscribe and ring that bell to get notifications of all of our new content. And for any more information, check out the link below or head across to lcgroup.co.uk.